The BNP Paribas Open is underway. The tournament was one of the first major events in the country to be canceled because of the coronavirus all the way back in March of last year. And now day one of the tournament is well underway with some of tennis's greatest stars serving it up on the court. And they're doing so with fans packing the stands. We have team coverage tonight live at 5. Blake Arthur will have highlights from today's action. And we begin with News Channel 3's Marion Bouchot, who is live from the Indian Wells Tennis Garden. And Marion, just how excited are fans about the return of tennis in the desert? Peter, I honestly, excited doesn't even cover it. They are just over the moon to be here. I'm excited too. This is my first BNP Open, and I am just so thankful to be here. And right here, we got the fans watching practice going down. And honestly, everyone is just so thankful to be here because it's been so such a long time and uh, you know paradise is finally back to usual tennis paradise is nothing without its fans it's awesome it's great to be back it's exciting it's so exciting to be here it's just i'm having a ball i want to be inspired i want to see if it looks and feels different here versus just seeing it on tv the venue teeming with life after more than a two-year hiatus fans from all over finally coming together for the unique event one of them is Valerie McPherson, who came from San Diego. The friendly faces, all the food, the uh, bars with all the drinks, it just reminded me of being at Disneyland, only it's not, it's, this is a real deal. This is real people, you know, battling out their, their, their craft. Claire Milburn is from San Luis Obispo, and she's been coming to the Open for 20 years. You know, partly it's about friends, too. Mm -hmm. Coming with friends and yeah. seeing friends here and reconnecting again as friends. Fans get to explore the different amenities at the venue, from lots of photo opportunities <laughs> to table tennis. <laughs> However, some have plans for outside the venue. We love to have our cocktails, so our happy hours, and, and they have the greatest happy hours here in the <laughs> desert, so. Every time I visit the valley, I, I discover a new hiking spot, new you know oasis, new restaurants. And um, it, never, it never ceases to amaze me how many things there are to do. So not only is Tennis Paradise coming back to life, but the valley along with it after the hard hits from the pandemic. Peter, I mean, the fans aren't the only ones excited to be back here. Some of the local restaurants here are excited just along with them. And coming up at 6, I talked to some of those local restaurants, and you'll be able to hear about the positive impacts that they're hoping to have at this year's Open. Live in Indian Wells, Marion Bouchot, News Channel 3. Nice to see all those smiles. Mm -hmm. All right, thanks, Marion.